And the teams are coming out on the pitch, and I'll run through the Hereford side for you again. Number one, Matt Yates. Two, Kieran Thomas. Three, Danny Greenslade. Four, Jordan Cullinan Lybird. Five, Harvey Smith. Six, Josh Dowling, the skipper. Seven, Tommy O'Sullivan. Eight, Tom Owen Evans. Nine, Elliot Richards. Ten, Jimmy Oates. Welcome back, Jimmy Oates, on Australia Day. Yes. Today. Eleven, Mike Simmons. And on the bench, Joel Dielna. Carl Finn, Theo Wharton, George Lloyd and James Roberts. Attacking options on the bench. Two matches that I'm following today. Uh, FC United of Manchester are at home um, in 20th place to Stockport who are in second. Uh, So that could be quite interesting. And of course Nuneaton Ashton United clash 22 place 21. So that'd be quite interesting. And we're off here at Croft Park as Hereford play the ball through the middle looking for Simmons and uh, Played down the line looking for number 11, Robert Dale Skip. It's interesting, this, their big bloke up front is also with number 11, just like ours. The ball has gone out of play. It's a Hereford throw. Simmons <laughs> goes up for the ball and uh, tries to win it, but uh, it's placed to, and it's going to be to Elliot Richards inside the area. A mistake from Jets. He shoots and it comes off defender, and Hereford win their first corner on the halfway line for a blithe throw. And uh, Elliot Richards is back to win that. Plays it infield, looking for Kieran Thomas. Kieran Thomas with it. Plays it back to Jordan Cullen and Lyber, who hooks it forward. Looking for Tom Owen Evans and Elliot Richards and Tom Owen Evans again. Tom Owen oh. Evans through. Tom Owen Evans through on goal. He's just going into the area now. Can he get a shot away? He does get yes. a shot away. And he scores. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Tom Owen right Evans goes. in the ninth, ninth minute has scored. And <laughs> he's gone to the Hereford supporters behind. As soon as the ball was played through to him, 10 yards out the area, he only had one thing on his mind, and that was to take the ball into the area. He outpaced his man, and he slid it past the goalkeeper, and he was celebrating that goal before it went in the back of the net. It just does seem a desperately long way away. We're very high up here. Yes. They play it into the area. How uh, Dale with a back flick gets it onto, uh, into the centre of the area. Is the shot going to come in? No. Oh. In the end, they make a mess of that. Yeah. And Jimmy Oates is able to put it over the top, looking for the run of Mike Simmons. And Mike Simmons has got loads of space here. And he turns and traps the ball. Plays it out to Tom Owen Evans on the left. And played into the area. It's going to be O'Sullivan on the edge of the area, but it's just a fraction offside. Infield, finding the number four, Kieran Green. Um, That's it back from Ricochet. And Elliot Richards puts his foot in there to try and stop it. But uh, the number four, Green gets it back now. And uh, lovely play by Kieran Thomas there. But the man turns him then. Uh, and he's tried to play through into the box and a shot comes in and it comes off uh, I think Matt Yates between, and, and Dowling between them blocked that he does gone out for a blithe corner on this on this left hand side so corner it's going to be right footed this should be an in swinger and it will swing in in this uh, breeze today I would imagine so it's in and the header goes up and uh, Dale is there and tries to flick it back and he does get it back to the corner taker and it's across and headed oh. over the bar by the defender running back there he's hit his head on he's the bar as he headed the over it's 1-0 so. to the Bulls in the 15th minute as uh, O'Sullivan gets it back to Greenslade Greenslade tries to get a low cross in and uh, the only thing that was going to come out of that low cross was immediately a corner because the first man cut it out and nothing he could do with it out for a corner so Elliot Richards goes over. Elliot Richards with the number nine. Two matches running. This is going to be a right-footed in-swinger from the far side. So uh, our big men go forward this time. All three centre-halves in the area. And it comes in. That's a teasing And cross. oh, there was almost again. He just evaded. I think it was um, uh, Harvey Smith on the line then. Just evaded him. But Hereford do... Uh, it has come off a Hereford player. It's a Blythe defensive throw. It's uh, played out to the right-hand side to Dale. He does wear orange boots. You don't need to wear orange <laughs> boots if you've played that many games into the area as well. Trickery on the edge of the area, and he goes through and tries to chip it across. Oh. But again, it was played off. It goes to the edge of the area, played back in. Ricochets off a Blythe attacker, and Elliot Richards is in there with Gowling, and eventually it's hooked away by Tom Owen Evans. And that, and then looking for a long ball over the top again, uh, and uh, it's played back nicely to their number seven, who is Jamie Holmes, into the area, looking for the run into the area then, and and uh, it was the number ten, I think, Sean yeah, Reed Sean into the Reed. box, but Matt Yates was able to come out and put that away for a corner. Plays it infield, 
I think it is number five, Buddle in there, play it over the top, and the header comes in from the edge of the six yard box, and it goes what, seven, eight yards wide. Uh, Jimmy Oates wearing a number 10 on this right hand side. He has to play it back, tries to beat his man, he does chip it over the top. Tom Owen Evans on the edge of the area again, gets onto his left foot and shoots, oh, and I tell you what, he wasn't over. that far over either. No. He went for the top corner, left footed shot from the right hand side of the penalty area. see now as the corner comes in hangs in the air and Yates punches it it's going to fall then and it drops goodness me that was just a missed shot and Elliot Richards Ooh, the end there. it's not a penalty Pen it's not a penalty it's outside the area it's outside the area but it was close it it's was Elliot Richards so I think Dale's going to hit one yes it looks like it and he does into the wall out for a corner Referee gives the corner, half time. but it's half time. Phew. Yeah, Wharton is on four. I think not Tommy O'Sullivan. Is he come on four? We're going to find Turns out. In the a board minute. round number two, Kieran Thomas. And we're underway here in the second half. Blythe play the ball back and over to the left hand side. Jimmy Oates tries to play a one two to Tom Owen Evans, but a heavy touch. Already brought about by the fact the wind is quite heavy down there. Ball over the head of Theo Wharton. Theo Wharton then. Uh, chasing back with his man don't get out play through the middle and Blythe over the bar Hereford a little bit lucky to get away from that then could make the pitch close. slick and the cross comes in high hanging cross to the far post headed oh, off the line no. by Hereford going to drop to Tom Owen Evans on the edge of the area but the referee gives nothing and a chip comes in and the shot goes wide and Hereford then then but good defending by Hereford Lang over the top, looking onto the right hand side, Good looking ball. for that man, Robert Dale. Great ball then, he tries to cut inside. It's going to ricochet through to O'Sullivan. O'Sullivan tries to find Tom Owen Evans, fails to do so, but Tom Owen Evans does take it up off Elliot Richards, well in by Elliot Richards. Now Elliot Richards with space down his left hand side as Hereford looked to push, get some men forward. There's only Tom Owen Evans there, and he, what a good run by Tom Owen Evans. Is he going to keep this ball in? He does. He goes into the oh. far side, and Mike Simmons then actually just sort of overran that, and he's gone out for a throw on the other side. And Mike Simmons not quite able to uh, get. No. Ball played over the top into the area, looking for the runner, Tom Owen Evans. But uh, he's played out of it by the number five, and he's oh, played back to the edge of the area. And a shot! Oh. Oh. A shot over the bar, left footed by Mike Simmons from the penalty spot, basically. And oh, another good chance for Hereford then. Dale has the ball in midfield but Richards able to get it through to Tom Owen Evans now Tom Owen Evans on his own but he's got pace down to the middle he's attacking the centre half and he plays it through to Simmons Simmons onto his left foot and shoots oh. wide when he should have got that on target really yeah. he was on the edge of the six yard box he was into the area and he didn't get his foot wrap his foot round it indeed Greenslade into the box looking for O'Sullivan drops to the edge of the area oh. to Jimmy Oates a first time shot by Jimmy Oates and it comes off the number four Kieran Green and goes out for a corner but I think <laughs> he struck that well that, that was that well I think yeah. that was on target yeah, but uh, we, we won't know but um, it is a Hereford corner Tom Owen Evans on the right hand side right footed out swinger this time and uh, comes the ball. and George it Lloyd. is it's a goal George Lloyd George Lloyd gets what a header. Just George come Lloyd on. he's just come on a substitute a header at the near post inside the far post I think it was Jimmy Oates I thought it was Jimmy was it? Was it? Number Sorry, it is Jimmy Oates. You're quite right. Mike Simmons up for this. Traps it, plays it over his shoulder. George Lloyd is there, being grappled onto, and he manages to play it back to Tom Owen Evans. Tom Owen Evans looking for the run through the middle. It's Elliot Richards. Elliot Richards gets a shot in. In the end, wrapped his foot around it too much. He's gone out of play for a goal kick. Harrison able to win the ball again and play it forward, but. Uh, Blythe are able to recycle it as they try and push men forward. But again, Simmons with the ball then. Can he get release the ball quickly? No, he plays out to the right-hand side then. A chance for break. A quick break is now gone, I suppose. He's played down for Jimmy Oates in a lot of space to the right-hand side. What can he do? He gets a cross in oh. and the header comes in. Almost the header comes in then from Walton. Carl Finn. He uh. just missed it, did Carl Finn. He's the player, the holding midfield player who picks him up, picks it up. They play it out to the right-hand side. Manages to be kept in, but... Uh, 
in the end. Danny Green slave missed the tackle out there, and the number two comes away with it. Alex Nicholson tries to get into the area, but Tom Owen Evans is able to take a pass off Joff Gurling and clear it, but they pick it up again in centre field to the home side. Try and play... Uh, one two on the edge of the area comes out to the right hand side looking for the run cross to the far post that looked like a handball but it wasn't oh. a shot the shot comes in there are lots of oohs and ahs then but it was very wide in the end as he sort of leant back the home side pick it up in the centre circle now and they've eight two tackles coming forward looking for a shot and oh, it's a goal keeper. by the number four Kieran Green Kieran Green and actually went through Yates straight through Matt Yates now, Greenslade with the ball on this left-hand side to chip it down the line. Simmons infield to George Lloyd, tries to turn on the edge of the area, but uh, beaten to it there as Blythe looked to get forward and the tackle comes in beautifully with Wharton. Wharton now in space. That's plays it through to ball. Simmons. Offside. And offside against Mike Simmons. He was a yard or two off, I think. So it's a throw to the home side. Uh, in an attacking position, they play infield now to the number nine who hasn't got a shirt number on his plate. The cross comes in from the right hand side and wide of the far post. Uh, got a touch on that. Yates got a touch on that. Yates got a touch. <laughs> well, it's a free kick out there on the wide left. It comes in to centre field. Yates goes up for it. Uh, it's going to drop uh, onto the penalty spot. And again, a Hereford player throughout to Shepherd to try and get it away quickly. And they do. They get it out. It's going to be a Let's throw to Hereford. Hereford. Throw, yeah. So, Tom Owen Evans with the free kick. We've only got three men up. It's played over to the far side. Elliot Richards up for this. He does, and he goes, oh, I say that, he dropped and he got it onto his left foot and he, he chipped it over the bar. At this stage, getting rid of it is the most important thing as Blythe had the ball on the edge of the box. They try and play a one-two and a turn in the area and it is a turn in the area and a cross goal and a great save yeah. by Matt Yates again. And he's gone out for a corner at the far side to Blythe. It's an away performance at the moment. This is excellent as Yates goes up and Good catches take. that. What a great take in a crowded penalty area. Five minutes. As we enter the last five minutes, plus whatever is added on here at Croft Park as Blythe winning in midfield over the top. But uh, Harvey Smith there. That's going to run into the penalty area. It is. Oh, and George, it, could it be it? a goal to Hereford? It's it is. Goal, yeah. It's for three. That was George Lloyd. Oh, Hereford. That was George Lloyd. He chipped the Brilliant. goalkeeper from the edge of the penalty area. What a goal. <laughs> what a great, great goal. We didn't get the name of that one wrong. No. It was George Lloyd. This time he does get the goal. We just need Absolutely. to be careful with this rain coming down now. The pitch Absolutely. is going to be slick. No uh, yeah. missed time tackles. And the uh, corner comes in and headed out. It's going to be picked up by Cole Finn now in loads of space. And he tries to release George Lloyd very quickly. And George Lloyd does. Oh, oh he couldn't quite get out to the right-hand side where Elliot Richards is running. And Blythe managed to pick it back up again. And down this right-hand side. And they've got a little bit of space. And into oh. the penalty area, and a shot, oh. and a great save by Ooh. Matt Yates. Oh, well, it's tipped it for over. a corner, yeah. from yeah. a from an attack by Hereford to a chance for Blythe. Yates to our rescue once again. Yeah, I think we, we have to say he was partly responsible for their first goal because it went straight through him. Yeah, but uh, and a header comes in from the corner, and a really nicely gathered by Yates. If he was responsible for that first goal, then he certainly saved a couple of others. Yeah, without without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, of course, Simo is down in the corner waiting to receive the ball to waste more time. But he's not 10 yards from the ball. <laughs> and worked well through Cole Finn. Cole Finn to Tom Owen Evans into the area. Can he get uh, across in? No, he doesn't. He gets it back and plays it into Cole Finn. Cole Finn gets it across the box. He does. Uh, it just flicked out. It's going to drop to the edge of the penalty. And Tom Owen Evans with a shot. Oh, oh it's just wide just in the far post. Right Tom Owen Evans. And... Uh, uh, maybe I'm getting greedy now, but 4-1 would be quite nice. <laughs> I'm happy with three. We're not losing the matches that we're playing poorly in at the moment. And we're always fighting back and getting something out of it. But today, we've never been behind. Oh, oh it's no. A, no, it's not. Hit the bar. It no, is. Gone. The ply you do follow it up for a consolation. Josh Gowling actually tried to hook it out. He hit the bar. Rebounded to the uh, attacker uh, who's put it in for three goals to two as Hereford kicked the ball long in downfield and it's headed back to the goalkeeper and the goalkeeper's got it he's going to hit this ball long now downfield 30, and the referee added on more time and 30 Gowling, seconds over the Gowling five. picks it up it. and the final whistle goes <laughs> and the Bulls have won 3-2 never behind in the match 
Um, and that last consolation was always going to be a consolation. There was never going to be the few more than the few seconds then. Yeah, OK, we've got problems, we've got faults. This is a tough league. Maybe our players, I think our players are stronger than they have been all season. I think we've got a better squad than we have all season. Whether the squad is yet strong enough for this league,